Good afternoon, everyone. We are from Tatum Emmanuel Lutheran College. Uh, I'm Daniel, this is Ocean, this is Jason, and this is Paco. Uh, in this presentation, we will talk about the difficulties and the unforgettable moments uh, during the process of living at school. Unfortunately, one of our teammates, Stratus, isn't here today, so we'll be presenting for him. Um, uh, because Janice isn't here today, so I'll be presenting for her. And she said that playing parkour and high pixel was the most unforgettable moment when she was building the school with, with us. And sometimes when we were tired and bored of placing flops, we turned the world to uh, survive balls and play with some parkour balls with uh, us outside the school. We usually went to uh, high pixel and play dead balls games and something like that. And um, it, was, uh, it was a lot of fun and it was unforgettable. Another unforgettable moment when uh, she mentioned was uh, trolling with TNTs in the school. She would trick um, us into uh, stepping on traps and activate TNT during some of the school and they would have to fix it. Although um, uh, she still helped uh, fixing it, it was very memorable and it has um, increased our team bond together. Um, and she said that one, uh, the most difficult thing to build was um, the volleyball court, uh, court because um, it was diagonal and plus she needed to build it according to the correct uh, ratio. So it was very, very hard and time consuming. When I was building the school, I faced a lot of difficulties. First of all, I had trouble using the film command sometimes because I always messed up the Y coordinates and the Z coordinates and caused a lot of problems. Uh, secondly, I also found armor stands and the invisible rise of frames a pain to deal with, as armor stands would always face the wrong direction sometimes, and I always forgot whether there was an invisible rise of on the block. Suddenly, she sometimes puts an item frame on item two. Thirdly, I had a lot of trouble using the replay mode, as it was the first time using it. Although there were lots of problems and uh, problems and troubles, I still managed to push through. There were also lots of unforgettable moments during the building process. Believe it or not, there was a time when I accidentally filled 3,000 blocks. But luckily, Ocean helped me fix it. And uh, also, playing high pixel with my teammates after building was also something to remember. The unforgettable thing, though, was staying up until midnight to play Minecraft, which greatly upset my mom. But either way, it was really fun playing Minecraft with my teammates, and it was a really unforgettable moment. Uh, the most unforgettable moments that I had when building the school were um, learning how to use structure blocks. Um, uh, before I even build, uh, even I uh, joined the competition, I have never learned of uh, trying to use uh, any of these uh, construction blocks. And um, I learned it because um, it didn't really benefit us. So, um, and despite it was very difficult, I tried to learn it, and it was uh, very great and delightful after I uh, successfully learned it. And the biggest difficulty I faced while building the school was uh, adding uh, ex uh, some additional details. Although I can build uh, the uh, basic <coughs> shape and uh, the uh, basic uh, uh, main, main part of the uh, required rooms, and adding additional details was uh, hard because um, just looking into the reference photo and zooming in it just make it look very blurry and I just and I can't find the details I should add and therefore I will see the answer in the front of Therefore I think adding uh, extra details is one of the hard things I I had troubles of suffering and restoring the school because some photos on Google Earth were taken in wired ang weird angles and were sometimes blocked by other things. Sometimes I, I was also impatient when, when building as some blocks and commands were troublesome. And as for unforgettable moments I had, the most memorable thing was the sense of achievement. Once I finished a part of the school on, on my own without any help and that made me feel really good and I was very motivated. Also, making a PowerPoint was something to remember and as it's not very good and the process of working out together to finish something like giving out suggestions, they are, they are fun. Um, 
about half a year ago, I came up with an idea to return my school in Manka. But soon I found that it was too boring and time consuming. So I abandoned the project. And after I joined this competition, I still thought the same fear and less time to face many scary issues. But it was my teammate who kept me more confident to finish.